Okay, for your uh, paper weaving of choice, this is the one where you're gonna choose um, however you want to cut your paper, whatever kinds of papers you wanna use, and then how you wanna assemble those. So like this was an example I showed you in class where they, this student had white paper, folded it in half, and they cut the uh, warp creatively. So like these curvy zigzag lines. They also then drew on the white paper and pencil to make this kind of texture. And then they cut strips from a magazine page. So you can see this face kind of woven in here. And they added strips of construction paper. So that's these color pieces for their web. So the web was cut straight. It's a combination of magazine pages and construction paper. And the warp was cut creatively. So that was one student's approach. Um, so this is your choice how you're going to do it. Um, this student uh, pre-painted some papers. So like these strips that are woven in of weft are um, painted with watercolor. So you have that pretty texture and colors. Um, and then they, they cut their uh, warp creatively. So you see the white paper is cut in curves like this. And then they also cut little tiny areas inside these leaves so that um, they could weave inside of those too. So the white paper is the warp and that was cut wavy and creatively. Then the strips of watercolor were woven in and then little tiny um, pieces of construction paper were cut to fill in these leaves. And then she added this cool little vine. Um, so that's how she chose to approach it. This is two pieces of painted paper that were cut and woven together. And you can uh, play around with the weft that sticks out. I mean, this could be also cut. This could be cut to be to look like fringe. Um, be as creative as you can. This was the one I showed you in class where they had two copies of the same image. They colored them each individually and then folded one in half and cut it straight and then they cut strips and wove that of the other piece into the first one. Um, so you can be thinking about, well, so maybe you paint a few pieces of paper 